31. Jonathan Brooks. Ooh. Ooh. Been a big afternoon. Made the pick early. Now Brooks makes the cut. It's face. Brooks makes the ice. Texas touchdown. I'm Alex Johnson. This is Yards for Fantasy. And today we're talking Texas running back Jonathan Brooks. We're going to dive into his background and college career, discuss the positives and negatives in his prospect profile, try to determine his dynasty value, and if and where you should target him in your rookie drafts. Jonathan Brooks, running back out of Texas. He's a red shirt sophomore. He's going to be just 20 years old at the day of the NFL draft. And he's listed at six feet, 207 pounds. Jonathan Brooks began his football journey at Hallettsville High School in Texas, where he also played basketball. His athleticism and versatility was on full display by playing both sides of the football, as well as returning kicks. And he was the punter. As a senior, Jonathan Brooks ran 295 times for an incredible 3,530 yards and 62 touchdowns. And that caught the attention of scouts, earning a four-star recruiting status and receiving offers from Texas, Texas Tech, Colorado State, Louisiana, and others. Brooks committed to Texas, where he played in just four games as a true freshman, before taking a red shirt. He finished with just 21 carries for 143 yards and one touchdown. And then Brooks spent the 2022 season behind both B. John Robinson and Roshan Johnson on the depth chart. And unsurprisingly, he only carried the ball 30 times, resulting in 197 rushing yards and five touchdowns. With both B. John Robinson and Roshan Johnson departing for the NFL in 2023, though, the path opened up for Jonathan Brooks to seize a significant role in the Texas backfield. The season began with him in a full-blown committee with C.J. Baxter before Jonathan Brooks emerged as the top dog. And in 11 games, Jonathan Brooks ran 187 times for 1,139 yards and 10 touchdowns. He added an additional 286 yards and another score on 28 receptions. That all came before he suffered a torn ACL on November 11th against TCU, though. And he actually compiled 178 total yards and two touchdowns in that game before the injury. But despite the brutal ending to his season, Jonathan Brooks still managed to earn second team all Big 12, and he declared for the NFL draft. But let's talk about the positives, the things that we like in Jonathan Brooks' profile. The first is he runs with patience, he runs with good vision. He's got great acceleration, which helps him reach that top speed quickly. He's got excellent lateral agility, allowing for quick cuts, navigating through traffic or in the open field. He's scheme versatile. He's going to fit in just about any rushing system. And he's got good receiving skills, and he provides quality pass protection. A lot of guys aren't good pass protectors coming out of college, so it's exciting when you do find a few who are. And maybe this doesn't directly translate to fantasy production, but it does help a guy stay on the field for passing downs. On the negative side, Jonathan Brooks has very limited experience in college production. And that's kind of what happens when you're behind B. John Robinson. He's also an upright runner, which can affect his leverage at times, you know, trying to break through tackles and such. He also has a slight build. I mean, he's not tiny like a Devon Achan or a Keaton Mitchell, but he's not a big back either. We talked about in the positive section that he does have some good receiving skills, that's mostly in his hands. He's a reliable pass catcher, but his route running is a work in progress. And then, of course, we got the ACL recovery. He suffered that late in the 2023 season, which could and likely will impact his rookie year. But before we get to my NFL comp and my draft projection for Jonathan Brooks, I do want to make sure you are aware that if you want to get your hands on some Jonathan Brooks shares, you don't have to wait for your rookie drafts. Underdog Fantasy makes it possible to draft these rookies right now. Go draft Jonathan Brooks. Go draft Marvin Harrison Jr. Go draft Brock Bowers today. And when you sign up for Underdog, use promo code YARDSPER to get a $100 instant deposit match. I'm already drafting 2024 teams, so I will probably see you in a draft room. The archetype for Jonathan Brooks is a one-cut slasher. My NFL comp for him is Devontae Freeman. 
and my draft projection, I expect him to come off the board sometime on day two. The injury will probably make him more of like a third rounder rather than a second rounder. The bottom line is Jonathan Brooks is an undersized running back who runs with good patience and vision, and he uses a variety of tactics to work his way to the second level of a defense. Once he finds the running lane he wants to hit, Brooks will quickly cut vertically up the field with impressive lateral agility and then use his top-notch acceleration to burst through the hole. And that, combined with his physicality and his power, make him a solid fit in just about any rushing scheme. Brooks has good enough speed to pick up chunks on the ground, but he's not quite fast enough to be considered a home run threat. He does get caught from behind from time to time. In the passing game, Jonathan Brooks does have some work to do as a route runner, but he can get there. He possesses natural hands and he's a reliable option out of the backfield. He will also be a trusted pass protector, which will only help his case to get on the field or stay on the field on third downs. At the NFL level, Jonathan Brooks projects as a committee back who can be deployed on all three downs. Given his little time as a lead running back, thanks to being stuck behind Bijan Robinson and Roshan Johnson for multiple seasons, Brooks is somewhat of a green prospect meaning he still has plenty of room to develop and showcase his skills that maybe we didn't get to see in his handful of games as a starter. The team that drafts him is definitely banking on him hitting that upside. However, the late season ACL injury will force him to miss all pre-draft workouts and will threaten the start of his rookie season. Depending on how teams feel about the medicals and his limited resume, Jonathan Brooks could slide down draft boards further than expected. As it stands now, though, he projects as a day two pick. And in Dynasty, he will make for a high upside, yet somewhat risky selection in the second round of our rookie drafts.